This was the royal city of the Lulus? Did they live inside? Hey! Wait up! Wow! Amazing! Wow! Hey! Who's that statue? Hey! Why are you ignoring me? It's your home after all! Wow! Huh? For how long are you going to sightsee? <laughs> it's very dangerous here. Frightening beasts could be hiding anywhere. Let's go through this tunnel. Oh. Uh, hey, wait up! Hey! Stone face! Where are you? Oh! Can you be more careful, please? It's too dark here. You can't blame me. This is a deep tunnel. Go in before the frightening beasts find us. Move. Huh? The walls show how the city became a floating city. Are these all real? Hmm. You Lulus are quite remarkable. The whole clan practicing rock controlling techniques? You guys really step by step made this city float in the sky. <laughs> Boring. <sighs> huh? Whoa! This. Look! What a gigantic stone face! The statue looks a lot like you. Not one bit. Your people seem to really worship him. <laughs> he must be remarkable. The only thing this individual has done was building the floating city. From then on, us Lulus became the most famous cowards. Instead of looking at these meaningless things, we need to hurry up. Frost is young and immature. Don't blame him for being rude. Please don't. <laughs> What are you mumbling about over there? Uh, nothing! The exit is straight ahead. Huh? Wow! Breathtaking! Although it's only ruins now, I can still imagine it being a very marvelous city back then. <sighs> if only the frightening beasts never showed up. Huh? Are all the frightening beasts in this hole? Yes. This leads to the floating palace at the very bottom. Diana is probably down there too. Now oh, someone in the lift. Huh? Someone what? Hey! An earthquake! This is the lift? You Lulus are quite something. This statue is... No matter how you look at it, you look just like him. So convenient. Hey, did that guy build a lift too? He's amazing. If you don't want to be frozen, shut up. <laughs> Get on. <laughs> When are we going down? Uh. Uh. You don't like this statue? The third king of the Lulus, King Fred. Many people said I look like him. Ah, oh, so it's the statue of a king. My father, mother, family members, they all look up to him and hope I'll become a king like him. But I'm not like him. And I don't want to be like him. 
Why? He's so cool! King Fred thought that as long as people hid in this floating city, they'd be out of harm's way. He was wrong for thinking that. The floating city can keep people safe. Keep people safe? The crystals you saw were the people he kept safe. If people weren't soft from centuries of stability, if they were stronger, then they would have fought to defend their home. King Fred thought he kept them safe, but he did the opposite. But my people have not realized this even to today. I will never be a king like that. I joined the warrior god gates to prove to them only strength can keep people safe and keep our kingdom safe. Then you left the warrior god gate without permission? Oh, to prove your strength, right? I got it. Although you look cold, you are reliable just like me. You're right. In order to prove myself, I cannot fail this mission. No matter what, I must save the Seal Guardian. You weren't abandoned like garbage. Are you a human or a beast? You are beautiful. Beautiful like a princess. You know what? I was a princess once. I'm not a princess. I'm the Black Rock King and I will conquer the world. Oh? I didn't know it was possible for cats to be the Black Rock King now. Who are you? I'm Snow. I used to be a Lulu princess. A Lulu princess? But you and Frost look nothing alike. Hmm. The descendants of those cowards do not deserve to be a Lulu. I don't care why you captured me, but... My guards will be here very soon. Hmm. Sure. You are my ticket out of here anyways. As for your guards, I really hope they can get here safely.